M0FXB, welcome to my channel, my videos on the Yesu FT710. So yeah, look at this, got the mouse plugged in here, working great. So look at the screen, so we can uh, tap the screen, put in the frequency if we want. We can choose AGC and it's all, you know, as you can see, it's working on both. Got the speed, just everything basically. We've even, oh look at that, we froze it, expand, contract, 3DS, on that slow, 3DS, everything's working, all the controls. Now I wonder if I can do the, the actual function, can't see that I can do the fun, I think I have to push the function on the, the radio, fair enough. Um, but yeah, there's the mouse and I'll just show you where it plugs in. Just here on the little USB there. The other USB, I've mean, been trying to use that for FT8, but I keep getting USB audio come up instead of USB codec. So it's, I'm not sure that that's working correctly, although it's controlling the radio. Okay, you can see I'm having great fun with this radio and uh, this display, believe it or not, I got from a secondhand shop for five pound. It really helps the experience, definitely. So it's a shame we can't select everything from the screen, but we can select a lot, look. Alk, mode, frequency input. If we could click there and then open up the function menu, that's gotta be doable in a firmware update. Oh yeah, the multi, gotta have that. The oscilloscope, AF, FFT. Can we click on that? Oh, look at that. We can actually click on that. ATT, 0, 20 dB. Yeah, we can click on the oscilloscope. RX, fixed, 3D, expand. Come on, this is good. Yeah, as you can tell, having great fun with this radio. I always leave mine on SWR. And uh, yeah, why have I got the volume turned up loud with um, nothing to listen to? Now in theory, I can pipe the audio from the back of the radio into this monitor. I don't want to risk it because I'm not sure, you know, about the ohms with the, with the built-in speakers. So I'm, I'm going to see if someone else has done that. Yeah, but working great. So it's the Yesu FT710 with budget external monitor and a DVI connection. It's not recommended to use a HDMI converter because you can get voltage feedback and that could be a problem with the radio. Bye for now, 73. Thanks for watching my channel. Catch you on air. This is the video for the mouse and the monitor.